Lucas Hock Barbosa versus Mateus Denise ended with one of the most controversial finishes to a grappling match in recent history. With seconds left on the clock, Mateus Denise, down on points, was able to get his arm around Hulk's neck. What is clear is that Denise's choke put Hulk to sleep right as the buzzer went, leaving him unconscious on the mat. But the question was whether the match should have been stopped before this happened. Let's take a close look at the ending to see whether Hulk or Denise deserve to win. Mateus hits the arm drag with seconds left in the match. You can see as Hulk slams him to the mat, time is about to expire. But the referee doesn't stop it and Mateus holds onto the choke until the ref says paro. There's no question Hulk is out, but when did the choke take effect? If we slow it down at key moments, we can see that Hulk is active right until the clock hits zero. He bridges into Denise and his hands only appear to drop long after the clock has stopped. Denise felt he won, so the referees spent a long time reviewing the video to make their decision. What's important to note is that Denise, through no fault of his own, had hold of the choke for over five seconds after time had expired. You can see right here that the referee was late in stopping the match. He lets go when the referee says stop, but at this point, Hulk is out. After careful review, the officials declared Hulk the winner, but it's clear there is unfinished business here. This was definitely one of the most unusual endings to a match that we've ever seen and a great example of the power of video replay.